each had their own reasons for going to war. All were remembered today at Island Bridge. Remember, Lord, those whose stories were unspoken and untold. Lord, remember them. Reeds were laid by the President, by ambassadors and by British Legion representatives from the Republic and the North. The ceremony was jointly organised by the State and the British Legion. Some came to remember as veterans, some in an official capacity, and many came to honour family members. I've been to his grave, yes. I uh, found it very emotional, um, because I was probably the first family member to stand at his grave, or kneel at his grave and say a prayer for him, since he was buried in 1917 in it. Because he was written out of history like the rest of them. And uh, until about 20 years ago, we never knew this man existed, you know. I come from Kilcock and County Kildare, and um, quite a few people uh, left that village for the First World War. Um, they were all neighbours. <clears throat> and um, uh, some more of them didn't return as well. Today's state ceremony is the last but one in a year of significant centenaries. Coleman O'Sullivan, RTE News.